It's Wednesday, May 16th, 2012, and uh, week eight, day three of Farrell's Extreme Body Shaping. Again, just did uh, cardio today. Uh, yesterday, I actually ran another three miles, so that puts me up to like nine, ten miles this week. Uh, we'll say nine miles that I've ran this week. And mortal that story running three miles Sunday, Monday, Tuesday for me right now, not a good idea. <laughs> Probably need a break. Uh, in between there. In fact, so I'm going to try and do another three miles tomorrow. Uh, but again, uh, what, a week and a half left, roughly, of the uh, 10 weeks for uh, Farrell's Extreme Body Shaping. And again, still feel fantastic finding out what I'm doing better. In fact, yesterday when I was running, I found myself doing hills and inclines better than what I've done before. So my endurance really picking up. Uh, the one thing that I really need to learn, though, when it comes to running is my breathing. That's the technique that I still need to uh, to, to hone down on is, is my breathing when, I, when I'm doing a run. But uh, otherwise, just doing good, feeling great. And again, uh, eight, eight and a half weeks into this and, uh, you know, almost done. So uh, really, really looking forward to it and uh, just seeing, you know, uh, I'm not sure exactly what my measurements are going to do. But it doesn't matter what they do. I just know what my overall body feels like. And then with the muscle that I'm building, uh, I'll just be uh, interested to see uh, the, the whole, uh, the, my BMI, uh, measured BMI at the end, where I've already dropped 10 points, uh, roughly 10 points, wondering how much more that I, I drop, you know, after uh, the other, the second five weeks of uh, Farrell's Extreme Body Shaping. But again, just feel really good about myself. Uh, again, my confidence really picking up and just feeling feeling top notch and I know I'm actually in better shape now than when I was in high school and even in high school even at the point now at the weight that I've lost I was still almost 100 pounds lighter than what I am now uh, but I still just feel so much better now than what I did then and again if this is something that you've been looking to do you know it's just that investment that you do in your life that investment you do to make you feel better about yourself uh, again it's going to give you confidence professionally personally it's just going to help you overall and people around you, I mean, it's it very important that you are getting the encouragement from, from those around you and uh, they're helping you through it rather than deterring you. And, uh, you know, just kind of always finding ways to criticize what you're doing. And But, you know, it's important to have that positiveness, uh, if that's a word, but you the, the, the positive comments from those around you rather than the negative things. And, you know, that's one thing that I'm finding that's really helping me a lot is all the positive comments that I'm getting uh, from doing uh, this, again, eight and a half weeks in, into it and uh, just having a great time. And just remember to do those investments into yourself because that's the biggest uh, investment that you're going to have that's really going to make you a better person overall in every aspect of your life. So make sure you're getting that done physically, mentally, and spiritually. So you're just, you know, getting a very good balance for yourself and uh, really putting yourself in a great fair mind and getting yourself exactly where you need to be in life and uh, getting those goals accomplished and uh, the visions that you have that you're getting better to to do that. Just like me, my my vision now is to do you know a 5K. Uh, my goal with the one that I was looking at, probably not going to be able to because I have to work that day now. But you know what? I still have that goal that I want to be able to do 5K in five weeks. So I still want to be able to run a 5K. And I'm doing so much better at it now than what I was three weeks ago when I started uh, doing the, the runs on Sundays with David and James and Steve. And of course, even better than that from when I did the one mile timed run eight and a half weeks ago when I started the Farrell's Extreme Body Shaping. So again, thank you for everything and thank you for going along this journey with me and I'm hoping it's helping you and encouraging you as much as it is me and helping me uh, get to that next level that I'm trying to get to. So have a great day until next time. Thanks.